Hi, I'm Chris Brook and these are today's stories. It's been a mixed picture for both Labour and the Tories in local elections yesterday as both have lost key councils. Labour lost control of Derby but replaced the Tories in power in Plymouth and became the biggest party in Trafford. One of their key goals was the three London councils of Wandsworth, Westminster and Barnet, all of which stayed blue. Locally, Labour held the Ellesmere Port Ward. It was contested in a by-election following the death of the previous councillor earlier this year. Elsewhere, a man from Runcorn has been jailed after admitting grooming a vulnerable teenage girl. Robert Bristow of Navington Road was only caught after her mum found inappropriate social media messages. The 26-year-old was given 12 months in prison and handed a 10-year sexual harm prevention order and will have to sign the sex offenders register for a decade. A Freedom of Information request has shown that nearly a million pounds of taxpayers' money was spent last year on policing badger culls in Cheshire. The culling is part of a DEFRA-backed program aimed at controlling bovine TB, which it estimates is costing us more than £100 million a year. And Twitter has told its 330 million users to change their passwords after a computer bug was identified. It meant some passwords were stored in plain text on its internal computer system. That's all for now. There's more on your radio. Goodbye.